In the following video, you will see a restoration example using Hiromi Japanese paper. We will be showing how to produce a perfect corresponding inlay with only the use of colored and natural colored Japanese papers, resulting in a perfect color match without needing further retouching. Other materials being used in this video, in addition to Japanese paper, include sturgeon glue, Clusel ethyl alcohol, and all a paintbrush, and a small-sized weight to add pressure during drying. With the help of using self-made color samples, you can then determine which colored and natural colored Japanese papers will be needed to begin. Spread a thin layer of sturgeon glue along the edge of the damaged area. Place a thin layer of 2.5 gram Hiromi Japanese paper. Press evenly using a Teflon folder and let dry under pressure. Any excess Japanese paper is easily torn away with tweezers. The document is then flipped to the other side. For the first layer, a luminescent film is placed under the object. Hostofen foil is placed over it as well as Japanese paper. Both are then lightly weighted to secure a position. Perforate the edge precisely by using an awl. And tear out the finished shape. The finished inlay is then brushed with sturgeon glue. The excess moisture is absorbed directly into the blotting board and not into the document. Polish the first layer of Japanese paper using a small amount of the Clusel ethyl alcohol mixture in a Teflon folder. Polishing with Clusel gives then a consistent appearance to the parchment and the new inlay. After polishing, cover with Holotex blotting board in a small weight. Let dry under pressure. A second layer, the colored layer, is then made using the method of fitting the inlay, gluing, and polishing. This is followed by a third layer using natural colored Japanese paper, and then a fourth layer using the same paper. With every layer using the same steps of gluing, polishing, and drying under pressure, here is a list of the Japanese papers used for this example in there. The finished appearance of the damaged area now matches completely to the rest of the original document using only a mixture of different colored Japanese papers. The exact amount of papers needed is determined by the thickness of the surrounding parchment and may vary.